yourself. A little of column A, a little of column B. I am the expendable one, after all. Oh, <laughs> don't worry, I'll protect you. We'll just have to... Well, this is a surprise. You're the Inquisitor, right? Bianca Davry, at your service. Any friend of Varric's is welcome here. Be careful saying things like that. Some of his friends you don't want to meet. Ancestors, you're tall. If this Inquisitor gig doesn't work out, you could make a killing getting things off high shelves. Bianca's got a lead on where Corypheus got his red lyrium. The site of Bartrand's folly, the tag Varric found, has been leaked. There's a deep roads entrance crawling with strange humans carting out red lyrium by the handful. How do we know they're not using multiple entrances to get to the Tag? Navigating the Deep Roads isn't like the surface. There's no accurate maps of the whole system, and there are cave-ins, dark spawn, lava floods. If you find a route that gets where you're going, you don't deviate. Trying to find another way could be deadly. You can get there from Orlais? It's a long way to the Free Marches. The Deep Roads are all connected, or they used to be. Collapses and such, some of them on purpose. They really are roads. They spanned the Dwarven Empire, went to every corner of the continent, maybe further. In theory, you can get to any Tig using the Deep Roads, but in practice, well, there's a reason nobody uses them anymore. Who could have given away the Tig's location? There were a few people who knew. Hirelings from the expedition, a couple of close friends. How they found out isn't important. What matters is we know where they are now. If it's such a secret, how do you know about it, Bianca? I told her. Right after the expedition, I wrote and told Bianca what we found. I had artifacts that needed buyers, and she had more contacts that would pay for them. Plus, I owed her. We need to deal with this. As long as he has this source, Corypheus is that much more powerful. I couldn't agree more. I'll keep an eye on their operation. If you're interested in shutting it down, you've got my help. Try not to leave me waiting too long, Varric. I've got my own work to do, you know. Right. That's not going to be trouble at all. Let me know when you want to head to the entrance. Don't know what you think you're doing. I'm being clapped at by a hen, evidently. Don't play the fool with me, young man. If I wanted to play the fool, I could be rather more convincing, I assure you. Your glib tongue does you no credit. You'd be surprised at the credit my tongue gets me, Your Reverence. Oh. I... What's going on here? It seems the revered mother is concerned about my undue influence over you. It is just concern. Your worship, you must know how this looks. You might need to spell it out, my dear. This man is of Tevinto. His presence at your side. The rumors alone. What's wrong with him being from Tevinto, specifically? I'm fully aware that not everyone from the Imperium is the same. How kind of you to notice. Yet still, you bow to the opinion of the masses. The opinion of the masses is based on centuries of evidence. What would you have me tell them? The truth? The truth is I do not know you, and neither do they. Thus, these rumors will continue. Oh? I'd like to hear what these rumors are, exactly. I... could not repeat them, Your Worship. Repeat them? So, you've shared them before. I... see. I meant no disrespect, Inquisitor. Only to ask after this man's intentions. If you feel he is without ulterior motive, then I humbly beg forgiveness of you both. Well, that's something. This sort of thing happens often, does it? <laughs> More than anyone tells you. 
No one knows their own reputation. Until someone helpfully informs them. There is that. She meant well, if that's of any concern. I don't know if you're aware, but the assumption in some corners is that you and I are... intimate. They don't know about Iron Bull, then? Don't know or don't care. Baseless insinuation is grand fun. I wonder what Iron Bull would think of this. If he's even heard. Something tells me he'd find it amusing. Perhaps it's odd to say, but... I think of you as a friend, Inquisitor. I have precious few friends. I didn't think to find one here. I... Uh... Don't speak. I detest confessions. And I'd like to get this over with. Allow me to say I'll stand beside you. Against Corypheus, my countryman, or spurious rumor. So long as you'll have me. Talk later. Goodbye. I'd like to talk about you and me. Sure, boss. What's up? Those times you talked about passing time with the serving girls. Is this what you do to them? <laughs> the serving girls spend most of their day following orders and feeling unimportant. They need someone who makes them feel special. Let's them cut loose with no repercussions. I let them bounce on top and tell them their tits look nice. Everybody wins. I mean, I used to. Long as we're doing this, you've got my complete attention. Do you have some free time? For you, always. Consider it done. Oh! Oh, Bells, it's you. Um, <clears throat> Morris. Sir Morris, I suppose. I am serving as quartermaster for Skyhold and its arriving throngs. Stores are growing, and so long as we have fair coin to restock, you and yours will be well served. <clears throat> the previous quartermaster survived Haven. Where is she? She... 
had views. Has views. Perfectly legitimate ones if you share them, Inquisitor. I believe it was felt that your quartermaster should be more palatable now that the Inquisition is in Orlais. She continues to serve, just not at the fore. <laughs> How's it going? Do we have what we need? With Skyhold shining like a beacon? You name it, it's here or on the way. I've wrung out the slackers, given them what for. I think... I think I like this job. As you were. We are here for you, Inquisitor. There is a... Rumor being circulated. It claims that you and Iron Bull... That you are... Are what? <sighs> Romantically involved. Are you asking because you're jealous? I... Was simply concerned. Nothing more. Concerned? For your reputation and that of the Inquisition. I'll happily leave the matter in your hands. Do you have any advice for me? We must root out the Venatori. The Tevinta Imperium cannot be allowed to gain a foothold in the south. That's enough for now. Another time, then. Inquisitor. You're the Inquisitor, hmm? Honored. Don't ruin it. Ruin it? By pretending to something you're not. If you want things just so, what I have to teach will be lost on a fool. Your people asked for an artificer. My name is Three Eyes. Let's get started. Thank you for coming. Craftsmen are always welcome. Enough of that. Treat it like a craft, you're dead. The artificer builds for battle. We survive through detail and efficiency in equal parts. 
What some forget is that artifice, not artistry.